Hello everyone, I'm Krishan Veer. I am developer advocate with Cisco DevNet, and I focus on security technologies. Um, I'm part of developer.cisco.com. It's an amazing resource for you to go learn not only Cisco technologies, uh, uh, but you can also learn Python programming, uh, REST API fundamentals. So there are a lot of free courses. You don't need to be a Cisco customer or a Cisco partner. You can use Google or Facebook type of login or GitHub ID to, uh, to register with uh, developer.cisco.com and you, you will get access to these amazing resources which we have there, which is Learning Labs. And then we also have sandboxes there where you can actually go and, and interact and develop uh, APIs and, and play with the real hardware which Cisco offers. So it's a great place, um, developers.cisco.com, DevNet, and that's the group I represent. Um, and I have with me Chris. Yep, hi. Uh, thanks, Veer. So my name is uh, Christopher van der Maade. I'm a uh, systems engineer based out of uh, the Netherlands. Uh, that's also where I live at the moment, of course. Um, I focus also on uh, security technologies. Uh, I'm a big fan of programming, and I work with Veer uh, more often. Um, Today uh, we will talk about a, uh, yeah, uh, an Umbrella API module that I've created together with Fear. Um, and basically what we will cover is the Umbrella uh, Enforcement and the Investigate API. So in this module, this module contains multiple parts. As you'll see in this video series, you can review all of them. First. Uh, I'll show you uh, what Umbrella is all about. So this, this basically brought introduction into Umbrella. It's not very deep dive, but it gives you a good view of what Umbrella does and how you can use these APIs. Then we'll talk about what is a REST API. So um, this is a separate video that you'll see. And uh, yeah, we'll go through the basics of uh, REST API requests and how that also relates to Umbrella API. Then I'll uh, give you an overview of all of the Umbrella APIs that are there. So this is the Enforcement API and the Investigate API, which we'll dive into a bit deeper. Uh, but there are also a couple of other APIs which we'll touch on uh, in this section. Um, after uh, discussing the Enforcement and the Investigate API, uh, we will, uh, I will actually do a demo uh, where we'll create a custom block list uh, with the Enforcement API. After that, I'll do another demo where you will be able to do threat hunting with the Investigate API. Uh, so this is a very cool one. Uh, it's a bit longer. Uh, we have a couple of scripts uh, there that you will uh, yeah, be able to review. And um, yeah, it should be fun. Now, as I mentioned, all of this is part of a, um, a DevNet Express security uh, track, as you can see here. So, um, the umbrella module is what we will discuss today, but there are other modules like Firepower, Advanced Malware Protection, ICE. There are more modules in there, so I definitely uh, recommend on view viewing those. Uh, in the umbrella module, uh, on, in the learninglabs.cisco.com, um, I've basically created a lab guide which will walk you through all of the scripts that I will demo today to you. So that is this one contains the actual hands-on exercise, and this one as well. And all of the other are more introductionary sections, which you can read through to review, for example, how the API works. Yeah, so, um, so just, to, yeah. just to add on it, um, this is available on, as I said, on DevNet, which is developer.cisco.com. And this is a new track which is coming, uh, uh, which we have now, which is a security track. And, and as Chris mentioned, that it has not only Umbrella, but other technologies like Firepower, AMP, ICE, Threat grid, and it's mostly focused on programming and APIs. How you can leverage APIs to your particular use cases, whether it is automation, or whether you're improving your workflow in general, or you are going uh, uh, any, you are following any SecOps uh, uh, type of uh, integrations you are doing in in house. So you, APIs are very useful when you do that, and this gives you a very nice overview of all the Cisco APIs which are available under um, security. So. Thank you, Chris. Yep, no problem. Yeah. Enjoy. Thank you, everyone.